One of the best ways to learn something is to teach it. How to market your YouTube channel. This vlog is going to be a little different. I'm going to be mixing in some tutorials within my daily vlog and life as a musician. One way to grow your YouTube channel is to produce really valuable content. Tutorials are hugely valuable on YouTube. I'll see how it goes. Let me know what you think in the comments if you like it or not. This is test and learn type of experiment. YouTube for musicians, how to market your YouTube channel. Four things that you have to do to grow your channel. The first thing is you need to know your metrics. There's one metric that you should be looking at every day. No, it is not subscribers, it is called watch time. That is just the total number of minutes or hours that someone watches your content. There are three things that you can do to increase the session watch time. It is consistency, storytelling, and cards. You have to be consistent with your content. If you're gonna win this YouTube game at all, you need to be uploading videos every single day. These videos have to be solid. They have to tell a story and they have to keep the audience engaged throughout so they actually accumulate that watch time throughout the video and they just don't drop off in the first 10 seconds. The third thing is cards. You want to be putting these cards that pop up in your YouTube videos that promote other videos that you have. I think today is a carnival day in Berlin, which means... <laughs> As I live in the main city of downtown, there's always um, people walking about, especially on my street. And my street has become so popular now because of this new graffiti. I think it might be a very well-known artist, but I haven't checked up on that yet. So the second thing, and how to market your YouTube channel, especially for musicians, are keywords and tagging. Keywords and tagging are really important because those are the two things YouTube uses to understand what a video is about, so they know where to rank it when someone searches for something. If you are a musician or you're a creator at all and you want to be ranking and you want to be found on YouTube, you need to be making videos that have titles that people are searching for. For example, how to play a song on guitar. People are searching those exact keywords. That is a good search term, however, the search volume for that is extremely high. So the likelihood that you will rank on a keyword like that is very slim. So it's important to go after more niche keywords like how to play a song on a 12 string acoustic guitar. That is more niche and probably will have much less search volume that you can make a video for that. When it comes to tagging, you want to be as descriptive as possible, but don't keyword stuff when it comes to tags. Just be as descriptive as possible to what the video is about. It's so nice out here right now. The sun is so warm. It's one of those days. I'm gonna spend a couple hours out here editing that video um, the White Couch uh, Music Interviews Episode 1 from yesterday. The third thing to keep in mind are thumbnails. Because when someone searches for a video on YouTube, they're not necessarily looking at the titles right away. They're looking at the images, and I do that myself. I look at the video image before I actually look at the title. The best rule of thumb for thumbnails I have them bright, have them contextual, but have them very clear as well. So clean, bright, and add context to what the video is about. The fourth thing, to how to market your YouTube channel. You've heard of analytics before. You need to be looking at this at the video level on specific click-through rates for your thumbnail videos, watch time, where people drop off. You need these feedback loops of your current videos to understand what's working and what's not. If you never look at your analytics, then your videos will never get better. So if you're looking how to market your YouTube channel, I seriously think those four things will help tremendously if you put those into practice.